It's Becca Boo here and welcome back to my channel. I'm sorry it's been a little bit since my last makeup tutorial, but for those of you that have stuck around, thank you guys so much. Today's look is going to be a recreation of this look I posted just yesterday. I did it before work and it was actually kind of like making me really mad. Like the wing got too thick and then I was like, oh my god, what am I gonna do? It's unbalanced. So I threw the blue line on, but I ended up really, really loving it and everyone loved it on Instagram as well. So I asked if uh, you guys wanted to see a tutorial on Instagram and you guys said yes. So I filmed it for you guys today. If you want to see how I got this eye look, then please keep on watching. All right, so I already have one eye done just so I could make sure I could do it again, actually. All right, so now we're going to be starting off with the Lime Crime Venus 2 palette, and I'm taking the shade Filter on my Morphe M502 brush, and I'm applying this to my upper crease area as my transition shade. Alright, so now I'm going into my Super Beauty Cupcakes in Monsters palette and I am taking the shade Sugar Diet on my MAC 217 brush and I am placing this in my crease using some windshield wiper motions and applying it on the outer third of my eye. Next, I am taking the Morphe brush and going over the crease area to make sure that is nice and diffused. Then I'm just adding more of Sugar Diet to the outer corner and in my crease, making sure it's nice and vibrant. And now I'm applying this to my lower lash line and making some very odd faces. And again, blending around the whole area and making sure the edges are nice and diffused. Now I'm taking the white from the Cupcakes and Monsters palette and this brush from my makeup set makeup brush set and going over the um, brow bone area to make sure that's diffused. Now I'm going to the Kat Von D Pastel Goth Palette and I'm taking the shade Clementine. On this shader brush from the Omnia and Royal Langnickel brush duo that we got in um, the BoxyCharm box last month and I'm placing this on the lid. Then I'm just picking up the MAC 217 and I'm going over the transition there. Now I'm taking the NYX Vivid Violet Liquid Liner and I'm going to be drawing a very thick wing today. Sorry it's blurry. <laughs> So this look is actually kind of easy. It doesn't have that many steps and I didn't even use that many products. So I'm just picking up my KVD Tattoo Liner and going over the very edge of my lash line, just for my lashes to sit on. Now I'm taking the Sephora Collections Stand Alive Jumbo Pencil and placing this in my waterline. And then I'm going to the Anastasia and Nicole Guerrero Glow Kit. I'm taking Daydream on a cosmetics pencil brush and I'm applying this to the inner corner of my eye. Next I'm going in with Lime Crime's Blue Milk Liquid Liner and I am drawing that graphic line in my crease. So I really like the, um, the Lime Crime Liquid Liners. The brush is really, really thin and you get a lot of precision with them, which I feel like you don't get with like, say, the NYX liners. So I do really like the, the Lime Crime Liquid Liners for like small details like this. So then I'm just going in and thickening up that dip right there, and that's the line. So I'm going in, back into the glow kit and taking glow getter and highlighting my brow bone. If you're lighter, you could use the, the more pearly one. And then for lashes, I'm taking Lena Lashes Serena Lashes, and this is the finished eye look. 
so this is the completed look I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial um, lips I wore the same thing I wore in the picture which is the Makeup Forever Artist Liquid Matte Lipstick in shade 101 however I lined my lips because they were kind of I went tanning today so uh, they were kind of like getting they were blending in so I used the Balm Pickup Liner in a cute one so I just lined with that thank you guys so much for watching uh, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel if you're not already and I will see you on my next video oh, oh.